David actually had to drag me over here because I could not get away <laughs> from that pasta. Raving it was about the pasta. So good. <laughs> well, our next guest, you know him, you love him. He's a regular PTL contributor who's also on KDK Radio here at the Home and Garden Show. Yeah, that's given him a lot of time to walk around and see all the exhibits. <laughs> so we asked him to find his absolute favorite things, and you have brought them here with you Absolutely. today. Absolutely. I stopped at all 1,800 booths. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> you did. Diligent research. We love so, that. I haven't slept in six days. <laughs> well, Andy Amrine, not that you need an introduction of TV True Value. Tell us what you brought here, and okay. let's start with some of this artwork. First off, you guys have to help me lift these. It's okay. really... Okay. This is a introduction to the world. Wow. Nobody has seen this. This is a first. It's only on PTL. But at the home show, last year, we introduced a company called Imagio. They do glass uh, walls and no grout type of backsplashes and shower stalls and so forth. And then between them and our friends, Mario and John Oprasic and JP mm -hmm. Droll, who are mm -hmm. Pittsburgh famous artists. And this is their, their this work. This is here. their work. The one you're holding is uh, Jono's. This mm -hmm. is JP's. Okay. And Beautiful. now, after a year of them working together, you can get their Pittsburgh artwork on glass. So nowhere else can you get glass and artwork. Right. Not metal, not fabric, not canvas, not paper, but this is real glass. Wow. So Very they take cool. the artwork, they make it into a glass, and you can mount it on the walls, or you can get an entire backsplash done with it, you can get an entire shower stall, you can get an entire wall in your house done with their artwork made into glasswork. It's beautiful. So it's a so company cool. here at the show, Maggio, or the artists are here at the show. It's very, cool. very unique stuff. I want to be careful this. with it. I know, it don't drop me. it. It would be you me would who it. drops it. <laughs> they're, actually, they're, actually pretty, they're actually very sturdy. And you also yeah. want to tell yes. us about Keystone Steel. Keystone Steel, another local company. I met these two young ladies, uh, and they, um, well, do you know what a plasma cutter is? No. Okay, plasma cutters are very neat. I love them. I want to own one, but of course there are tens of thousands of dollars. <laughs> and they take steel, steel plates, and they could, with a plasma cutter, cut out anything you want. So these are just two of their unique pieces, something that says, hello, 412, right. or anything that you can use inside, outside, barn, yard, whatever, and then you could decorate it from there. But once again, Pittsburgh proud, so this is just some artwork from uh, Keystone Steel Company here in Pittsburgh, but uh, they're at the home show. Very nice. Okay. All right, and the next thing is not so artsy, but functional. Functional. Yeah. Me with the, in the industry and so forth, we are... Uh, um, Sintagas. 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 Okay. If I hope I said it right, I apologize <laughs> if I didn't. But down in front here, this is a cinder block and some wood and stones, and it's a rubber coating. And think of it in Pittsburgh. We've talked about products before to keep your house sealed. Right. So if you have a lot of water coming in, or you're building a new foundation uh, and you've cleaned your whole foundation out, how well do you think it would be sealed if you take and actually spray rubber? over top of the entire foundation. Right. right. Nothing is ever, ever going to leak in again. Now you do have to dig it out, but yeah. it's a foolproof. So it's another battle we have here in Pittsburgh that you can uh, coat your wall outside and nothing will ever penetrate in ever again. So that's something yeah, that, very important to a lot of people here. Good stuff here in Pittsburgh. So <laughs> and we and, can't leave out the rustic log The furniture. rustic log. Uh, bomb. Uh, bomb Rustic Log Company. I mean, there's a lot of furniture companies here, but nothing mm -hmm. that looks like this. And I love cabins. I love the wilderness. I love the outdoors and Boy Scouts, Girl Scouts, and all that. But he has a booth full of nothing but rustic log furniture. So really from nice. tables and stools and chairs and rockers and everything else with it. Oh, yeah, another sure. reason to come to the home show. Just some amazing, some amazing uh, Doesn't woodwork. that look like a perfect stool to belly up to the bar? It does. Yes. And then you could spin, so and you don't you have to get up. You can just spin on it. So yeah. I want to put Heather. I want to put the. Or I want to put Heather on here and spin around. And just spin around. What do you think? My balance isn't so good these okay. days. All right. <laughs> Thanks to Andy Amrine of EV True Value for checking out all 1,800 exhibits for yes. us. Remarkable, <laughs> Andy.